Hi, I'm Janine Venius, and I'm here to talk about biomimicry, which is a whole new way of solving design challenges by asking nature's advice. 3.8, that's how many billions of years life has been on Earth. And in that time, organisms have learned to live within their means, but with really elegant and incredible designs. Look at this peacock feather. We see this exuberance of color. There's actually only one color in this feather. It's brown. The color that you see is created with layered structures. They bounce light back to create that color to your eye. And uh, Qualcomm has a new display screen called Mirasol that does the same thing. It's got these layered pixels that bounce light back to create color. So there's no backlighting, ultra low power, which is great. Life is always surprising us with its ingenious and sustainable ideas. One of them is that this is made of a very simple material called keratin. It's the same material that's in your skin or your, or your hair. It's one of only five polymers in the natural world. We use about 350 polymers or plastics. Every time we want a new function, we add a new plastic and it lasts forever in a landfill. What organisms do is they take these very simple building blocks and they add design, structure, architecture to matter. And then they're able to recycle or upcycle that material into something else very, very easily. So what if you want to get into biomimicry design? The best way is to go to asknature.org. It's run by the Biomimicry Institute. We're organizing all biological information by design and engineering function. It's a huge job because there's 30 million species. And each of them has hundreds of adaptations. So stay tuned on Ask Nature. The other way is to go to biomimicry.net and take one of our classes. We have courses from one hour to one week to two years. And what we do in these courses is we go to beautiful places, surround ourselves with biological elders. We think that with their help, we can finally learn to come home to this planet, to fit in here at last and for good on this home that is ours, but not ours alone. So join us.